Aircut Nation. Today, I'm going to do a few drills with the brand new Edgun Leshy 2. I believe there's about a hundred of these in the United States right now. I just received mine last night. I opted for 22 caliber, 350 millimeter barrel. I've put enough pellets through it to zero in the Daydal Stalker scope at 50 yards and the Hawk Red Dot at 20 yards. I've got to tell you, aside from the rear air tube and the foldable stock, this is a pretty far departure from the Leshy Classic. Uh, I've owned several Leshy Classics, all in 22 caliber, and lots of different variations, uh, configurations of it. Um, the Leshy Classic is like a tinkerer's dream. In 22 caliber, I was able to adjust it from 12 foot pounds all the way up to 35, almost 40 foot pounds of energy, and it was single shot. And this Leshy 2, this is a freaking beast, okay? It comes in semi automatic, eight shots, and it came tuned at 900 feet per second with 18 grain pellets. Uh, I called Brian at Ed Gun West and I said, hey Brian, can I detune this a little bit? And um, the short answer is no, <laughs> you really can't. Um, he tried to explain the relationship between the um, plenum and the hammerless valve and uh, went into some things I really didn't understand. Uh, but long and short, you can adjust the regulator a little bit down, uh, but it really doesn't do much. Um, you can adjust it up to increase the power if you like, uh, but I'm really not into that. Um, but this air gun, the Leshy 2, is primarily designed to take it out of the box, fill it up, and start shooting. It's not designed to be tinkering around with all the different parts in it. Um, there are different components, accessories, uh, rail guards, silencers, hand grips, that kind of stuff that you can um, accessorize with it, but it really wasn't designed um, for tuning it. <laughs> Go figure. Uh, anyways, enough talking. Let's go do some drills. That gun Lushy 2. It's got two eight round magazines. I think I'll take eight shots here at PRS. Run down range and take eight shots from CQB. Um, taking two shots from each position. Let's do it. Air guns.
So these are all my shots from uh, just under 50 yards of PRS. Uh, I think this might have been my first shot, I can't remember. This trigger will take a little bit of getting used to. It's not bad, I mean not bad at all. It's not a match grade trigger, but it's pretty good. Group the rest of these really good. And this is all from um, CQB at 20 yards with my red dot. I am pretty happy with that. I couldn't be happier actually. So let's do another run. Leshy two, drill number two. Let's mix in some more uh, semi-supported and unsupported positions. Air guns. Pretty excited about that. So, this was from uh, 50 yards PRS. Uh, group spread open a little bit, but uh, I was shooting some uh, semi offhand and offhand. Uh, keep in mind, this is six inch target, and I mean, the goal is to hit anywhere between a six and 10 or 12 inch target, the body shot, and uh, I'd say I accomplished that. And this was uh, CQB, all uh, red dot, semi offhand and offhand, and uh, two uh, spinning shots. Man, it is freaking hot out here. It's supposed to be fall and it's still like 90 degrees out. So, head gun leshy too. Ah, this is a pretty unique air gun. Um, honestly, it feels a lot like I'm shooting a firearm, but I'm doing drills safely and quietly in my own backyard. So, I'm pretty stoked on it. More to come.